What an inter- entertaining race this has been. I mean, hopefully we get a good start on the uh, pit lap, especially after we get the one time around and everything such as that. So, I mean, my goodness, one of the more better 500s I've ever seen. And they're still interviewing people. I don't think ever in my life from the almost 20 years, or not 20 years, but more than 17 years I've watched 500. I've never seen a red flag at the 500. So, my God, this is going to be a fight for the finish, I tell you. But you know what? I had three bets. One bet was on Scott Dixon. Now he's all the way down. Erickson, I think, was my third one. Hopefully, Erickson wins this one. I didn't have Castro Nevis, but I thought he'd have an easy shot. And it's just been a lot of Indiana storylines. I've loved how Daly's been all race today. Uh, the Noblesville native, being a Bloomington native, and a Vincent's native, being a Vincent's native, I understand how being it in Indiana, in Indiana is really tough, especially racing at the 500. I mean, I don't understand the racing part, but I do understand how it is like to be in Indiana and root for victory. Sorry if I'm being a little confused. I'm not trying to act confusing right now. I'm just really, really anxious because, to say the least, my goodness. Okay, are we going to go ahead? Are we going to go ahead? My God. I mean, what a bunch of ups and downs. I can't count how many lead changes. Like 20? I do like Erickson. He just needs a good restart. He just needs a really good restart, especially when we come back out. We'll see what happens. I mean, I also had Alexander Rossi as one of my picks as well. And now they're saying red flag again, or are they... Oh, now they're zooming out, so now they're saying caution. All right. Oh, boy. All you guys get to see is reactions. That's it. And I'll this time show the TV view. So you guys, if you do miss this race... I'll make sure you guys all have it right here. And you're not seeing my face like you did when Rich Strike won the Derby. So they're going to go around one more time. One lap to go? Jesus. Jeez. Wow. He was basically my... 10 to 1 odds. This has been a family tradition of mine to watch the Indianapolis 500. My uncle actually went to the Indy 500 from the early 60s all the way until... 2001 when he had passed away he wasn't able to go to the one that i won because he died on march 25th been a dream all my life to be an indy car driver and now we get to see who's gonna win the 106th indianapolis 500 and i want to hear in the comments that i'm too white or something oh boy here we freaking go two laps to go here we go, boys! Here we go. Who's gonna do it? They're racing. Oh, I thought for a minute they were gonna go in the pit stops. Look at him go, playing that defense really well. Oh my God, these announcers just making my heart race. At least it won't be as bad as one it was we saw in the All Star race. Come on, let's go! It's been thrilling already. Hopefully, no J.R. Hildebrand in the fourth turn. No way. He's playing defense. Look at how he's playing defense. Oh, no. 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 Oh, what a save. He saved his ass. Sorry. All right. We might say it, but I can't say it yet. Oh, my God. 
Do you seeing this? Are you seeing this defense Erickson's playing right now? My God. Oh, there's a cost and it's over. It's over. It's over. It's over. Erickson has won the Indianapolis 500. Let's go! All the way through, and he's won the 500. That was a great race. Great race. My goodness. It's over. Oh, man. What a great race. Not much of a reaction by me, but boy, oh, boy, another win for Ganassi. Those are words I want to hear one day. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.